Hi, I'm Libby Wild, mom to the Wild Brothers. Our family works as Christian missionaries in Asia Pacific. When I was a little girl, my mom used to read to me. As I grew up, I spent most of my babysitting money on books to read. When our boys were growing up, I spent a big part of our school morning reading. The written word is a wonderful privilege that we often take for granted. We can learn so much from books, and the Bible is the most important of the books. The Bible is the only book that is inspired by God. Through the Bible, God made a way that we could know how the world began, how he worked among mankind throughout history, what we can know about his character, what is expected of us, and much more. We have the great opportunity of reading the Bible in our own language, English. Did you know that many people in the world do not have the Bible in their own language? The greatest book in the world is not available to everyone. That was true of the tribe that we went to work with in Asia Pacific. Their language was only known orally. They didn't have a written language when we moved into their territory, so they didn't have any books in their language. We had to learn their language, and then my husband Mike and our coworker Tim developed an alphabet that would represent their spoken language. Some of the first things we wrote down in their language were Bible lessons and portions of the Bible so we could begin teaching them the message that God has given people in His Word. Now they're able to read the message that God has preserved in their very own language. Did you know, according to the latest statistics, that over 180 million people do not have a single verse of the Bible in their own language? Let us thank God today that we have the Bible written in our own language. Lord, we thank you so much that you chose for us to be born into a people group that has your word written in our language. Thank you that today we can come here and learn about the Bible that is not like any other book. We don't want to take it for granted that we have the privilege of knowing what the Bible teaches us. Please make us diligent to learn and share what we have learned with others. Lord, today we pray also for those who are doing the hard work of translating your message into many different languages. We pray that it would be accurate and speak clearly to those who have not yet heard the gospel. In Jesus' name we pray, amen.